Be seated, folks. Next, we go to the Pike County Courthouse in Waverly, Ohio, for the sentencing of Charlie Reeder. The former Pike County Sheriff pleaded guilty to two counts of theft in office and tampering with evidence. The veteran lawman allegedly stole roughly $5,000, which had been confiscated in other cases. According to police, he used the money to support a gambling problem. Reader was originally looking at 18 different charges, but to get that number knocked down to five, he changed his plea to guilty. He appears before Judge Patricia Cosgrove. So at this time, we'll proceed with sentencing. For his crimes, Reader's looking at a maximum sentence of eight years in prison. The emotional defendant pleads with the judge for the minimum sentence. Community service. Morning, Your Honor. I stand here before you today to take accountability for the, my actions. As a sheriff of Ohio, I shed, <clears throat> excuse me, I shed bad light on the office of sheriff. For this, I am terribly sorry. If I could go back and change it, I would a million times. There's another box of Kleenex. Oh. For this, this is not who I am. I have and I now pray that the court will find mercy on me. And I beg the court they see fit to grant me community control. I am a good person. I made bad decisions and choices. After expressing remorse for his crimes, Reeder begs the judge to consider the impact a prison sentence would have on his family. I'm asking all this so that I have the opportunity to watch my son graduate from high school. My daughter is getting married in October so that I can be there for her. And my wife, so that I can be a husband that I haven't been in 25 years due to my career. Yonner, please do not send me to prison. I have run, but I'm not run. I still have a lot of good left in me. I thank you for your time. When he's finished, the judge has one thing to ask the defendant. The big question uh, I have, and is on everyone's mind, I'm assuming, is, I guess, why did you take the money? I took the money. And mind you, this does not excuse it, but from drug dealers that took it from parents of very poor people in this county. According to Reader, he spent much of that money to support charities in the community. But there's also evidence he built up a sizable gambling debt. And the judge is not feeling sympathetic. You've been in law enforcement for 24 years. We all choose our profession, and we have to conduct ourselves with integrity so that everyone uh, trusts us. It cannot be underestimated the damage that you have caused to the citizens of Pike County, to law enforcement who every day get up, uh, face the same sort of stresses that you do. They, they go all home at night, uh, they get up in the morning. The sacrifices that these men and women have made, uh, I think you've made a mockery of them. Reader is sentenced to a total of six and a half years. But because some of those counts will run concurrently, meaning at the same time, Reader will only actually have to serve three years in prison. He's also barred from holding public office in Ohio and can no longer serve as a peace officer. Thanks for being a fan of CourtCam. Subscribe to AE to never miss a new video and catch full episodes on AETV.com.